another beautiful day in the Jeep. Where the gawks are ugly, the view is shifty, and the chrome domes have serious static electricity issues. Having fun in there? You know me. A continual party. Okay, that's enough for him. I'm getting off this catwalk. Too bad you can't pour it out, Flango. There's tons of cool stuff you'd be able to do here in my dad's store. Hey, you can always look forward to tangling with Antoine. Goody. Let's find the rest of that sword then. And fast. Flango out. If the sword's been on level three the whole time, why hasn't Ancalon found it? I don't know. Yet. But don't get too excited about that break. Yeah, because as soon as we find all the rest of the sword pieces, Ancalon and the rest of Team Evil will be there to beat us. Now more than ever, we have to be fast, focused, and... Fueled with milk. Dad. Uh, no protests. Just because you want to hang with your peoples, there's no reason to skip breakfast. It's peeps, Dad. Peeps. Yeah. Oh, Blueberry? Choice of champions. All right, Danger D. Wayne. Time to go meet Megan. Dwayne, wait. Keep warm. And remember to be home in time for our mathletes game. Okay, Dad. Later. of the sword of Gan, master. Show me the terminus protrusion. There's nothing there, my lord. You fool! <laughs> Retrieve it now or feel my wrath. You know what to do. And if it makes trouble for Zix and her humans, even better. Now go! Level three. And it looks like we got an inventory upgrade. Bad news is, so did they. Very soon, Anquan will be fully regenerated. If he regains his strength, the entire universe will be enslaved, and the world as we know it will cease to exist. We've no time to lose. We have to get the Sword of Gamp before Anquan's minions find it. The enemy is everywhere, and as Anquan gets stronger, so do they. We have to work as a team. No doubts, no hesitation, or all is lost. Everything we've faced so far has been basic training. Time to get serious. Bring it on! Megan, freeze! Porta portal blocker. Handy. So, where do you think we'll find the. Magnetar! Shields up! Ah! No fire! That looked like fun. You okay, Dwayne? The thing was, and then he... I don't like this. If it didn't fight us, it means it's up to worse. What could possibly be worse than it wanting to neutralize us? You really want the answer to that? Guess not. There's the portal. Riley, Megan, with me. We'll try to get the hilt from the Magnathar outside of the keep. Flango, follow Dwayne to where he originally found the hilt. Maybe the blade is there. Danger D. Wayne is on it. Couldn't I do something else? Like fight a gawk squad? Blindfolded? You can do that? Cool. Zix. Flango, there is no time for debate. I need you to follow Dwayne. I guess you forgot about the tight landing. Okay, so what do we do when we find the Magnathar? Contain him and retrieve the hilt without giving him an opportunity to jump. But what if he does get within jumping range? What do we do to protect ourselves? We surround him and grab hands. A Magnathar can't jump when it's being circled like that. It gets unbalanced by the bodies closing in, and it can't jump into any one being. Unbalanced. That's good. Let's check outside first. Did a 
quick sweep of the mall, making it still upstairs at the movie theater, but we didn't see anybody acting like a magnifier host. Got it. Magnathar slime, this way. Uh, Magnathar slime is that like a giant slug, but more evil. Looks like our boy left the mall. Uh, we went outside. How are we going to find him? Isn't his trail going to be covered over by cars or people walking over it? Or... No, it's not tangible like a footprint that can be erased. It's more like an indelible suboptic print. Um, in English, please. If he hasn't gone back into the keep, we won't lose him. Ugh, brother. Really makes you wonder how humans survive this long, doesn't it? I think it's this way, Flango. Come on! Magnathar slime on the knob. He's inside. In Dwayne's house? Good thing Dewey isn't home. He'd have a fit. Locked. Let's check the window. I think this is where I found the hilt. I don't think this is where I found the hilt. Why am I not surprised? If Dad and I built that, we'd totally win the robot challenge. I mean, just look at those giant, sharp, whirling... <laughs> Relax. We can take on this blade-wielding hunk of junk. I'm, I'm not scared. <laughs> Keep watch. We don't want to be taken by surprise. Well, it's just the housekeeper. Zix, Dwayne doesn't have a housekeeper. Dewey would never trust anyone to clean around his piles of papers and electronic bits. Cool. I, I mean, deadly. <laughs> so what do we do now? Go in. Magnathar didn't drop the hilt when he left the keep, so it's probably on that woman. And maybe we can find whatever else Magnathar's looking for. Just don't get too close. Why can't we just neutralize first and ask questions later? Flango's dropping off on you. Oh, let's be careful. The Magnathar has still jumped into an innocent woman. She's leaving the den. Go in this way. You two go around the back and cut her off. Do something! Resembling anything! My adhesive boomerang? <laughs> What's Grappler V10? How did I get here? What's the last thing you remember? I was on my way through the mall. Uh, there was a bright light, and now I'm here. Um, you knocked on our door. You were disoriented. Here, let me show you the way back to the mall. Thank you. You're very kind. Hmm.
Let's cross over and see what old Sawhands was guarding. You go first. No, no. Lizards before humans. Is Danger Duane scared? Bad news, kid. Blade, no gems, no nothing. This was pointless. Worst news, Blango. We're trapped. This Magnathar is obsessed with Dwayne. First it jumps into him, now it breaks into his house. He jumped into Dwayne because he wanted the hilt. And now I bet the Magnathar thinks that Dwayne has something of value. But what? Whatever it is, Dwayne doesn't realize he has it. And it's not something he has on him now, because it would have shaken out of him back in the keep. It's not at his house either. So the only other place that Dwayne has been is Dewey's store. The Magnathar jumps into Dewey. That would be a disaster. Helping. What is this? What, what, I didn't put any batteries in these things. How could it be going on like this? Let's go get this thing off. And what's crazy with that? Oh, watch out! Sorry! This is on again. How did this get? What are you doing on that? What? What? This is Dwayne crazy. You can help me. I'm looking for a thin piece of metal. Oh, who put that in there? I mean, what's going on? Small piece of metal. Okay. Ah, uh, metal. I know I got a piece of metal back here somewhere. Okay. Oh. Let's see what. Let's, let's try that, right? Oh, I think it's. I'm freezing. Try hopping up and down. I'm stuck. All right, hang on. Uh, uh. Zix, we need help. There's a horrible noise. What happened? Some kind of power surge. Where's Wayne? The bait club. Uh, you need a hand? <laughs> Somebody stop that car. Hello, Magnathar. What? I can hardly hear you. It's like totally nuts in here. Nice try. Don't even think it. Magnathars can't jump into my spaces. Too bad. Your oculoscope won't work, Zix Funky Z. Too bad. Ooh. You got me. <laughs> Do you have any idea how badly Onkalon is going to make you suffer? No, probably not. Hey, back off. Nice bluff. But face it, when it comes to Onkalon, you're terrified. Is anyone else feeling warm? Because there's a lot of hot air in here, and I think it's time to shut off its source. For good. <laughs> should have confused her. She shouldn't have been able to break free and jump through the portal. Why isn't this thing acting like it should? Maybe being locked in the keep so close to Onkelon has mutated it somehow. Well, that's a reassuring thought. That Magnetar's wasted enough of my time. We have to find what it was looking for and get that hilt back. Start looking for anything unusual. What about this? Next. Too bad you didn't freeze from the head down. I'm keeping my vocal cords working. Why? So you can call for help and have some gawks come and find us sitting here like chewy popsicles? Oh, 
Good point. Can you access your HUD? If you can get the boomerang, you can snap the ice off my tail. Then I could use my tail to get the ice off of you. Ouch! Hurry. Count to three. One, two... Wait, why? Don't ever do that again. I pay a fortune in rent, and all I ask is that they maintain their power. This is definitely going to be on the next agenda of the Glen River Mall of Business Association. This is gonna take forever. Are you kids looking for something specific? Uh, Zix, um, needs to find some found art pieces for her art project that she got assigned. Oh, well, I'm glad that art is still part of the curriculum at your school, Zix. Creativity is very important. This is gonna take forever. Well, then we better step it up. Now, what is that? An oculoscope? Never heard of it. What does it do? Um, it lets you look at the pieces under an infrared light, uh, because... 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 Um, oh... Because the final piece is gonna be displayed under infrared light with some goggles for the viewer to see it. Amazing the things they have you kids doing. In my day, we stuck to painting and drawing. Impressive collection, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, very, very. Well, wait here. I've got two more boxes in the back room we can sort through. <laughs> Way to go, Riley. Two more boxes. Shoddy bridge. They just don't make them in one piece like they used to. On the plus side, at least there's a bottom. Somewhere. I think that pebble hit something on the way down. What? I don't know. Couldn't see anything. Well, that's helpful. No, really. You know how Zix always says not to trust your eyes and then keep? Maybe this is one of those times. Maybe we need to make a leap of faith. Literally. Get serious. I am. Let's jump. On three. Do I have one, a choice? Two, three. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you're smarter than you look. Thanks, Flango. Whoa, check it out. A snowboard thingy. A keep runner. <laughs> it's your lucky day. Six. I have been looking for this for months. Uh, I must remember to give this back to Dwayne. Hmm. Could I see that, please? Sure. You know, Dwayne might be looking for that, and since you'll surely see him before I do, would you please return it to him? Yeah. Zex, look at this. Is it a Ganthian symbol? What does it say? It's the symbol for balance. What does that mean? Specifically? I'm not sure. Time to go back into the keep and get that hilt. Excellent. I'm so in the mood to kick some Magdathar butt. What's the plan? Well, the Magdathar wants this, right? Right. Well, we're not going to trade that, are we? Oh, no. I'm not in a sharing mood. <laughs> Welcoming party. Six is here. Greet her. I've got a little something of yours. And you've definitely got something of mine. I think the welcoming party's here. So I 
a giant robot saved Flango and me from freezing for eternity and got cool inventory. <laughs> what did you do today, Riley? Oh, I don't know. How about, uh, tracked and fought a magnetar to get back the piece of the hilt you lost? Actually, yeah, I already talked to Megan about that, and she told me that she was the one who got it. No, that, that was a that was yeah. a team effort. Awkward. <laughs> it was. Yeah. Was it? Yeah. Back to the hilt. Uh, six. Time to see what we were fighting for. Six, can you translate this? Yes. Humility will prove a hero great. Compassion do not underestimate. Loyalty must choose the way. Leadership a cost will pay. Respect will duly earn its place. Courage to meet face to face. And then made flesh will strike a blow to send the darkness far below. You know, the whole time the Magnathar was in Dwayne's body spying on us yesterday, this piece was just sitting in Dwayne's pocket. We're really lucky the Magnathar didn't get it. Yeah, I don't even want to think about it. But what does it mean? Like, I get the striking a blow part. That's the sword being used to defeat Onkelon. But what about the rest? Maybe it means that whoever actually wields the sword must have those qualities in order for the sword to work. It's kind of vague, isn't it? It's a prophecy. That's how they come. Yeah, well, for once it would be nice to get a clear set of instructions. Sorry, Riley. Fighting evil doesn't come with a handbook.